Hello, YouTube. Welcome to That Much Life, a uh, regular edition. We're going to actually do uh, Munchkin Warhammer Age of Sigmar, because I unboxed it a while back, and we have not had a chance to play it yet with the Just What's in the Box game. Uh, it does come with its own board, Ooh. play board thing, but uh, we use the Mat of Mayhem, because I love the Mat of Mayhem. <laughs> Mayhem <laughs> So mayhemiest, mayhemiest. Yes. I say there's a lot of mayhem going on on the the uh, board here, and I wanted to show off the art a little bit. Yeah, yeah. So let me show it. Yeah, yeah. Fun stuff. Me, like, me. You know, squig. Yeah. Number one squig. Number one squig. Uh, number one uh, squig. So yeah, that's it. Orc. Apparently you die at number three because it's death. Oh no, <laughs> he's dead. But uh, yeah, so. I'll put that away. But other than that, we're just playing with what's in the box. Mm -hmm. However, it does come with a die, so. <laughs> and the bag is a bit heavier now. You may have noticed. Uh, well, you didn't notice, but you know, you will notice now. If you watch the unboxing, you'll notice. But uh, it'll have the uh, the new Warhammer dice in it, but it also has the Pathfinder dice in it, which means that I've added six dice to this bag that don't have Munchkin heads on them. <laughs> Which you might know as our house rule, uh, we draw blind out of the bag, which means that you can draw one that'll roll a one. And I have the the twelve days of Blarksmith Advent calendar sitting here. This is just after day six. Woo! And uh, go check out those videos if you want. And Corey is here for the first time since I started the 12 Days of Blargsmith, so he has his that pictures. That everyone! Yes! <laughs> and to all a good... <laughs> <laughs> so uh, he's going to open his uh, boosters here. <laughs> ah. <laughs> well, they're his. <laughs> 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 Number one, Beastie Boys. That's a rare. It's a beastie. Actually, the number of Beastie monsters in your stash. Show the Beastie deck, perhaps. Uh, just a boring old beetle. <laughs> Name green katana. I like that one because it has smack, but it also like basically gives you bleed. Yeah, that's interesting. Absent of gambling. Ooh, gambling, gambling, gambling. Mercenaries. Ah. I love mercenaries. Hard work. Another beastie. Plus three for each made a weapon to the end of the fight. Ooh. Yeah, I was say I, I was telling Tank about that the uh, uh, hard work is very good against like multiple weapon decks. Yeah, yeah. Like my cinematic encumbrance limits deck with all the cudgels and eleven footballs and stuff. Uh, high roller. No. Really, as you roll die, roll five or six, you collect, and then you get bigger. Yep. Beast be gone. Another common trinkets. Okay. Cheaty McCheaterson. That's a rare. I got one of those. Usually have. Yes, the start of the fight when the defender is ready. Zap, move the committed card to your hand and move the committed goal to your purse. And this is one of the Maybe it was cheating, maybe it wasn't. Mm hmm. I also got a litter bug. Uh, it's a sire, do you spill one? Mm. Uh, with a witching bargain. Ouchy and ouchy and bargain. Because, you know, ouch. Mm hmm. And concert security. So I got four rares, so that's not bad. I'm my first pack. <laughs> Four out of twelve. Yeah. Like, it's all like common and rare, right? Yeah, there's no bees. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But still, pretty happy with that. Four rares. Yeah. Alright. Open the 
I will fail. That's a common. Two damage to each hero, draw a card. I like that one and uh, the accident. <laughs> Dibs. Dibs. Another common. Wow. Yeah, it costs two, but then you get you take three back. Yeah, that's interesting. Lodge of complaints. Make mischiefs cost more. Increase the gold cost of all mischief cards and squish to get my points. A gold finch. Finch. A gold finch. More beastie boys. Mm -hmm. That's a rare. So now I got two of the beastie boys. Yes. Denied. <laughs> Use when target loot deals damage to your hard monster. Prevent that damage. Yep. Boom. Net benefit. Uh, throw them in the net. Oof. Hunting guide. When your opponent hires at least a monster and zap it. That's actually a hunting book. Yes. Hunting. <laughs> Upgrade. Ooh. Let's push a monster into your stash. Look through your deck for a monster card. Reveal it. Move to your hands and shuffle your deck. That's not bad. It's not walking dreads. It's a plutonium dragon. Bluebird of Bitterness. Oh. All heroes take two damage. It's a Gokai monster and clear deck. Yep. Blackmail! There's a V-Rare. Yeah. There are two damage to a hero. I think I've got like five of those. <laughs> and I'll be Bach. Ah, a Bard yeah. card. So, you know, that's kind of rare Stash anyway. <laughs> Stash it. Let's see here. Mmm, making bacon. Oh, that's eight. Oh, wow. That's a good one. It's a V. Yes. Group skull cost of this by one gold for each card in your discard pile. Oh, wow. Your cycle two and shuffle your deck. Oh, nice. Yeah. So it's it, filling for me. Right, so it can be free. Yeah, it can be. That's not bad. That's good for a, for a, a, a turn deck. Like, if you're going to have a lot of discards, if you have some stuff that gets rid of a lot of stuff, or uh, if you have a lot of mischiefs. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah. Um, cool. You get a deck with a, with some of those and a <coughs> Dumpster of Doom. That would be a good one. Uh, that pig just looks deck. too happy cooking bacon, though. Yeah, he's a cannibal. Ah, uh, makes, makes sense. Good old Blarg! There he is! Hey, the eponymous Blarg! <laughs> he comes with sacks of vomit. <laughs> is that what that is? <laughs> looks like he's throwing up on the house. Yeah, he... Yeah, because uh, he's because uh, that's a whole bunch of bottles of uh, Pepto. Oh, I see it down there. Okay. Yeah, because it's on the poster. <laughs> Cutosaurus. Oh. <laughs> oh. Just started committed weapon with three or higher. That's not bad. Miser Stone. That's another B. It's a trinket. Use one target hero has two or more stashed monsters with will cost a one or less. It's apt to deal one damage to that hero. Yeah, I kind of like that, but it has too much uh, qualifiers. Two or more stashed monsters with will cost a one or less. Nah, it seems like that would be hard to get necessarily. Another high roller, another watch of complaints, another goldfish. Honey badger! They don't give a fudge. <laughs> When a weapon deals damage to this, that damage to zero. Hey, it's another one of those things. Yeah, it's yeah, kind of invincible against weapons. Smoke bomb. Flip runaway marker, give blood one. Your opponent must flip their runaway marker. Ooh, shut down. Yep. Ring of Zots. Each time you play a mischief, collect one. Move two tokens from this card to target hero and See, this would be good for that uh for that bravado deck that you wanted to make, the the rainbow bravado deck. Oh yeah, yeah you're talking about the bravado one. Yeah, because yeah. it's something that can flip your runaway marker. Right there. So you get that, and uh, you get the blue suede shoes, and you get the Transylvania twist, and you get uh, the last ditch. Lots of stuff. And then you get all the things with bravado, and you just keep flipping and dipping. There's a parrot. Mm -hmm. And fire. <laughs> fire. 
I like fire. That is that can be devastating. Let's see. Alright, we're making our way through the packs. Number four. three, four, four, four. Boop! <laughs> boop! Love that card. <laughs> Anytime I play it, I have to say boop! <laughs> and boop a snoot. <laughs> Manual of Health. You can level your one. I like that, but like. It's limited. I mean, right, it's it. limited because you, one, you can't gain a level like past 10, obviously. But it's a three-star loot, so you have to be at least level three to put it out. So at most, you're going to get seven life from that. Yeah. Then I got a hippopede. Ooh. <laughs> Somebody, I'm not mentioning names, but he's 875 miles from here, has used the hippopede against me many times to good effect. Yeah, two for four ones, not bad. Yeah. And then I got into an accident. Aha! Ah! Aha! Yes, I did. Play when a fight has been declared, you roll the die. One and two, you take one or two damage, depending on how much it's shown. Three and six, the attacker must stash the committed card. And you walk the gold to their purse. Nice. Yeah. So one gold, put that monster away. Basically, 66% chance. Yeah. Pretty good. Another hunting guide. Virtuous vacuum. Ooh, life perception. I need more for that. Perfect. Yeah, we were talking. About, I was talking about that on the episode that you that you should get a virtuous vacuum. Like yeah. and like I said, it has kind of a, a hefty ca- a, yeah hefty caveat at the end, but hours, but that's only if you get rid of it. Yeah. Welcome to Holy Ground. More cleric stuff. When heroes caught cheating, it deals one damage to that hero. Unless squish. There's a craven. Oh, I like them. Use the attack of this Ooh, that's not bad. <laughs> when you you use that against somebody who has a heavy loot deck. Yeah. Uh, Monty's roadside carnival. Ah. Your each hero is working step. Uh, here spills three unless they pay a gold. Ooh, that might be good in my uh, resource denial deck. <laughs> Cheetah. She's a cheetah Pokemon. Oh man. Like if you had a like an in of improbable rooms deck in uh, Thief, if you had the Roadside Carnival and the uh, Sticks Kayak rental, it would cost them two gold a turn. Ah. <laughs> then Harry Brimstone. Checking for cheating, you can also take one damage if you draw. Oh, let's see. That's a copter. That's a copter. Then beast mode. But I may give you one ranger to cancel this card. Go pay gold. Here you have back. Mm-hmm. That's Hard martial games. One attack, one health, and subtype beast E for this fight. Yep. <laughs> Blarg! More Blarg! More Blarg. Wounded pride. We are filled with the Blargsmith spirit. Of course. Of course, Beastie Boys number three. Wow. Well, that's all the Beastie Boys I need. (laughs) Another angry katana. Hey, look, and then. Yay! (laughs) I don't love you. Cool. Excellent. Uh, Bullrog and the Honey Badger and the Hard Mark. All in the reflexes. First target weapon you control the damage of the Enchanted Kodrak. Zap target armor, so it's still one. Cheetah and Tropha Elixir Mixer. Ooh. That's a pretty good one. You don't want to be full squish, does that make it? Come, 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 come. The W had all comments in it except for Beastie Boys. Wow. Yeah. So let's do it. 
it, the, the, the top loader has some tape on it, but at least it'll protect your card on the way home. Sure. <clears throat> the Plains of Pain. Ooh. Any hero, higher than monster, all heroes take one damage. Ooh. That is some damage. I right, spilled bathtub. Oh, yeah. Your card is done unzapped. I'm going to That was a pretty mean one, too. Yeah. Ambulance Chaser. Mean locations in that. In the beach fight, and Zappas of any hero is bleeding. Man, we got two health. Hey, another vacuum of the virtuous variety. Excellent. Overcharging Rhino. Ooh, he looks very charged. If you will pay for this, look through your deck and choose at least a monster card with three attack or less. Reveal it, move your hand. That seems okay. It's a carry unit. Heroes must commit at least two gold when starting a fight. If it's a squish, give your opponent gold. Spirit Guide! I like that guy. Ah. He's in my cleric deck. He's in my Axes and Allies <sighs> deck. Ooh, the tides have turned, my friend. Swanky. V. That's a V, yeah. And there's a Ring of Zots. Ooh. An R. And another V, a Black Mail. Wow. And another R, Beast Mode. Wow. That was a good pack. <laughs> And a white knight, which is a common. Feel one damage target monster that is not undead. Yeah, two beast modes. Yeah, and I'm making bacon. You had a lot of ranger cards for a blarg pack. Or for, you know, yeah. a set of blarg packs. And then in my... Is this my first in? I don't know. I think so. It might be. Uh, I don't know I've gotten another W before, but I don't know which one that was. Or the other ones. School of Badassery. Uh, hot Poker. Uh... The one from the main set. Is that There's three in the main set. Three in the main set. Yeah. The, the School of Badassery, Hot Poker, and uh, the X Monster. You have an X Monster. X Monster, that's it. <laughs> Alright, I like it. That's not bad. And then Fashion Furious, the W, is the uh, Altered Ego. Ah. And the W in Grave Danger is the Resurrector set, which is the only card I don't have yet. <laughs> like the only Munchkin CCG card I don't have yet. Hmm. Except for a couple of promos. The only card, a CCG card that you can get in a box that I don't have yet. I like what I've got so far. Excellent. Somebody wants me to make a beastie deck, though. Apparently. Oh, beastie boy is only on vacation. <laughs> You need a beastie deck with a bunch of locations. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Alrighty. That's pretty cool. Cool. And then I still got six more to go. Yep. Woo, who knows what I could get. So next week when he comes by, then he'll have more to open. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Very Blarg's miss, everyone. Very Blarg's miss. <laughs> awesome. Alright, now we'll play Monster or something. Yep. Zoink. So on the seventh day of Blurgeness, I will put a link to this episode in there. Again, the Man of Mayhem takes up a lot of uh, real estate. Yeah.
sword that is Celestite. Okay, sounds fancy. Yes, it is now a plus seven sword. Woo! Uh, okay, I guess that's that. My turn. Yep. Hey look, Nighthawk again. <laughs> I'll uh, be a Nighthawk. Oh, oh, give me something I can use then. Um, I got a plus four sword. Deal. <laughs> yep, I can use it. Yeah. Yay! I wouldn't do that to it. Not this early. Not this early. Alright, and then I'll fight a Sigmapede. We got a lion here. Yes. Alright. Munchkin's get no bonuses from foot gear in this combat. Whatever. It would. I just chop in with my sword. Uh, I got nothing. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, I'm good with that. Forward somewhere. It has six kinds of things. Actually, now can I go to this one instead? Sure. Okay. I just realized I have exactly how to do this or something. No. Okay. Woo! These are rows. Things I can move. Also, does have plus one treasure or plus one in combat? Plus one treasure. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. <laughs> Curse, battle shock. You must immediately run away from the next monster you face. If you are in combat when this is played, you must run away from all the monsters you are fighting. Uh, yeah, but sometime soon. <laughs> Well, in that case, I want to get that out of the way. I'll face the scry room. Chaos. I failed. Discard down to two cards in your hand. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> First time? Uh, yeah. Hey, Lily, you told me to wake you up at 8 o'clock. Oh, that's lame. Sorry, what'd you say? Of level three or below. Oh! <laughs> of course, I'm four. <laughs> Plague's galore. Each of the player may play a curse on you and draw a face down door to replace it. Yeah, bad stuff's not really that bad. Yeah, a curse probably would later by now. Yeah, I don't have to 
Um, but let me see what I can get up to. He's technically 13. I'm 8. Uh, I've got a black amulet and fever cactus stew. <laughs> I got the card. Damn it! Why'd I do that? You know that. <laughs> Does that mean you're waiting? Yeah. Mm. Play on my sheets. Six plus eight is fourteen. The thirteen. Mm. Well, then I should probably throw in this reinforcement of a ravening dire flock. Say what? Yeah. Play along with the monster from your hand. The monster joins the fight just as just as one of the monster card. Monsters defeated got one extra treasure. Mm. So it's nine. But plus four because you have no headgear. Oh. So. Plus 13. But that's what I was. Ain't I a stinker? Yeah. <laughs> Could do that. What's that say? You throw as many cards from your hands as the number you rolled. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Alright, well, then I guess I'll push you. Huh. No, I've been cursed. Not to change my army. Aww. Hey, look, there's no one. <laughs> I don't like you. Hey, I don't like you. <laughs> like Wandering in big old 13 months. <laughs> and I gotta run away from him. Oh, um, if you didn't say, then it's the main one. Okay. Okay, so you can play a curse on me. Woo! Alright. <laughs> too much. And then this guy! Yep. Boy, do I need to pull another one or no? Uh, oh yeah, if you want to roll a seven. <laughs> seven to good. But that's not a seven. It is not. Minus one to run away, so it's actually a two. Yeah. <laughs> that's it. You rolled a three, so... Discard three cards. Yeah. Door and treasure. Ta-da! Mm-hmm. Well, that was fun. <laughs> now we both have no cards. <laughs> Your turn. Ah! Glotkin! Once four against... Stormcast Eternals. We're now pursuing level three or below. Yes! Mm. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, Let's see, seven. Oh, wait, I get to look at two, because I have rock eye. Rock eye? Yeah. Do you have an eye with a rock in it? Yeah, you can't pick cards up. (laughs) While you have this, you may look at two cards when you kick down the door and choose one to encounter, discarding the other one. But you also have minus one to run away, because of the lost depth perception. Uh, Yeah, I'll definitely get rid of the lose your best item. So So you are going to walk away from him after all. (laughs) Yeah. Those are pretty bad. <laughs> wow. Alrighty then. His best stuff includes Suffer the Top Curse in the Discard Pile. Which is the one you just discarded! <laughs> <laughs> Six, perfectly. Seven, eight, nine, ten, like twelve. Twelve. <laughs> But you won't pursue me. Later! Bye! <laughs> don't go in that room. There's a huge monster and a pile of poop. And a pile of poop. <laughs> we don't know which one came from where. <laughs> Alrighty, so. Yep. Door! Ah, micro quick. Minus five, your next combat against an undead monster. Keep this in front of you as a micro But well, I'm not hot, so it might still be okay. Yes. That's my door, and that's all we want. Okay. That was fun. Go ahead. I remember being an idol. Cardas Valentian. He's undead. That's true. But I don't have to run away from him. Undead may join. Even with a wandering monster card. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. No other undead may join. 
Uh, so, yeah, okay. One, two, Kurdos. Yay, I killed that thing! All by myself! Ah, I disagree. <laughs> Original. I disagree! <laughs> Negative. Two, count two, treasure. One, and uh, two. Ah, that was cold. Woo! Aw, but I'm not skating. Alright, well I gotta go up a level card, but it says you may discard this instead to draw three face down treasures. There. Wow, that's pretty good. Yeah. You found an artifact of power! And said, screw this, I want other stuff. Ooh, I have a steed. Ooh, it's the good one. Mm -hmm. The Tusk Gore Chariot. Ooh, an extra plus five when fighting a single monster. Mm. Wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, I killed that. So yeah, now I'm done. There. Had enough. Had enough. I'm drunk. Hi, baby. Do you know? Hi, baby. Hi, baby. You see my babies? Hi, babies. I'll fight the branch wraith. The branch Indian? Eight to six. Can I kill it? Um. Oddly enough, I did not get any uh, one shots. Thankfully, my shadow kills it. Three treasures because I'm on that. No. Oh, oh, oh. Oi, oi, oi. Okay. Still boy. Can I say? Oh, yeah. Double. And say you have to choose before you look at your treasures. Yeah. I did. No, which would have mattered anyway. Okay. Oh, I got the thing I used to play all the time. Horn uh -huh. Fang! Oh, awesome. <laughs> I played Ogres, and I loved my Horn Fang. Horn Fang. He had a, uh, one of his dice inside his Horn Fang because it displeased him <laughs> on yes. many, many occasions. Indeed. Like, he would roll it, and it would roll bad. It would roll ones, and therefore he put it to the side to be a leadership guy, and then he rolled it and rolled a six. <laughs> yep. It would just act up every time. Yep. <laughs> All right. And so when we were putting his Morn Fang together, he dropped it in there. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, you're being sealed up forever, you asshole die. <laughs> All righty. Um, yeah, I guess that's that. Okay. Mm -hmm. He did Knight of Slanesh. Yay, an army! Zink! Oh. In humanity, one shots you play to help monsters have an extra plus two combat bonus. Oh, that's nice. Uh, you may roll to run away from a curse. If you succeed, put it in your hand. Oh, wow. Those both good. I could have looked at two, but I would have kept <coughs> that one. <laughs> and I will loot the room. Now you can see what you want to loot. Woo! I am an alliance of a hidden knight of Slanesh. Oh, jeez, you're always getting the alliances. Har. <laughs> Done. Uh, let's see here. Festus the Leech Lord. Ooh. Last three against I have one of those. It could be that. <laughs> uh, since I'm going So I'll be an Ideneth instead of a Nighthawk. Now I'm my three! Mm. I did it. All I can do is scowl. Yay! <laughs> Scowling. I get to scowl real hard. Mm. Mm. 
Yes. <laughs> Zink. Three point. One, two, three. Level up to something. Yeah, like that. Mini curses. Community yeah. curses played by opponents are plus two in combat. Yeah, should be a mini your curses, mister. <laughs> to all the curses I have in my treasure cards? That's right. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Well, let's see. I'm going to set down my hammer blade. There, so I can get a nail for the battle plan. Ooh. Right. <laughs> Scratch it across the chalkboard. That's my battle plan. <laughs> Six. I like the battle plan. I can kill. Repeat. Here we go. That Ignite of Slanesh. <laughs> you can be a Ignite of oh, Slanesh aligned with Ignite of Slanesh. Look at you. Alright. Mm. Okay. Let's see. I will discard the Ignite of Slanesh and look at Battle Trained. Play on a single Chaos or Undead Monster. All monsters of that type get an extra plus three and are worth one extra treasure if defeated. If the monster is both chaos and undead, choose one or the other. Okay. And then I still don't have a monster, so I loot. Done. Mm. Yar. Skink. You get on the box. Monster. Well, it's just a skink. <laughs> nice. I killed the skink. Still got nothing. Hooray! Hooah! 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 Two treasures. Right? Oh, wait, then I moved on. Yep. Uh, these two. Cheat one item or plus one to run away. Cheat one item is definitely temporary. Yes. I guess plus one to run away. Okay. Okay, screw the battle plan. Mm -hmm. I got uh, Banmar the White Blade. <laughs> screw the battle plan! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see, so I have headgear, Crown of Conquest. Ooh. What's up for Chaos Monsters? Alright. Hmm. Still haven't fought an undead monster. This is never going to happen. I know, right? Go ahead. I remember this time looking at two. I don't know which one of these I want! Me, 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 my Nemo. One of them is hilarious, and one of them is a monster. Mm. <laughs> I think it could be a hilarious monster. You know what? I know what that. Okay, I'm gonna discard Queen Neferata mm -hmm. and go with Chaos Storm! Uh -oh. If this is drawn face up, it takes effect immediately. Otherwise, you may play it at any time except during combat. Not, uh, not just yours, anyone's. Shuffle the door discards and deal one of those doors to each player. Do the same with the treasure discards. Put any remaining cards at the bottom of their respective decks. Why are there treasures in here? <laughs> like, do I have to shuffle the treasures or not? Yeah, do, go ahead and shuffle the treasures. <laughs> There's not very many of them, so you know, it won't take them out. <laughs> no, no, just the treasure. Just the discards. Oh. Oops, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. <laughs> okay. Shuffle the discards. And then deal one of them to each of us, and then put the rest of that on the bottom of the deck. Oh, I see. One for you, one for me. Yep. First of all. One for you, one for me. 
for this one. Uh-huh. That's <laughs> cool. And I will face the fire belly. Fire flame attacks used by the munchkins count for the fire belly instead. I don't have any fire flame attacks. Hmm. Level two. Yes. Not doesn't really much, does it? Yeah, it's a nine plus seven is sixteen, eighteen. Oh, that's my. Oh, three, eighteen, twenty-one. Just with that. Oh, you wrecked me with that. One. Ah, okay, fine, fine, fine. Uh. Ooh. Cool. And <laughs> it's a one-headed. A volt spear. Wow. Wow. Here's my <coughs> sword clogs over there. So I have like a... Alrighty. Before I open the door, I'm going to sell some stuff like this hammer blade and this ravaging claw. Okay. Which I sold earlier and got back. Those <laughs> <laughs> ravaging claws, they always come back to you. The new boom dagger. Neat. That was three in combat, but it doesn't matter because I have the gift of the Spire God. Oh. So I can go to whichever one on nine I want, right? Yep. Uh, yeah, I'll just go to plus three in focus. Combat. <laughs> Woo! Jump across the board. Yep. The gift of the spider god. <laughs> Boing. Boing. Alright, so now I'm level 9. Let's see what we got here. Go back uh, to level 1. Oh. <laughs> nope, it's a monster. Plus 5 against Skaven and Human Knight or Sludge. Plus 10 against both. Let me get those. Oh. Hmm. Twenty three. Yeah. To ten. Yeah. You say all I have is that. And there you got the potion. <laughs> I had it earlier. Which is four when I throw it, but fourteen. Nine more. Nine more. Yeah. Or ten. <laughs> or turn it undead and then let's see. Or turn it undead. Ooh, that would be great. <laughs> and it would be discard. Nope. <laughs> or discard. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I killed the Sora Sunblood for the game. I got nothing. That was yeah. crazy. I couldn't get a monster to save my life. Yeah, I kept getting all the monsters even though you kept looking at two cards. Oh, right. I was oh, looking at two cards at a time. Yeah, I know, right? Neither of them being monsters. <laughs> well, there was one where you threw a monster away, but that was because you wanted Yeah, to I wanted chaos. Chaos. <laughs> chaos is fun. She was also a level 14 monster, and I was afraid of what she might have had. Yeah, I did have uh, Plague Scroll... Uh, lose your best item curse and arcane bolt. So yeah. Three, oh well, I say the the lose your best item curse would have been great because I had that. Shade glass. Play when you are the target of curse to win a player. <laughs> That's no good. <laughs> that would have been fun actually. Yeah. But still. <laughs> Man, that was. Quite one-sided, even though I had two really great items. Like this plus seven sword and this plus nine, basically, Tuscor Chariot. Sometimes it's just a matter of whether the monsters want to visit you or not. I know, right? <laughs> they didn't want to visit me because I was I had this really great sword and a really great chariot. <laughs> yeah. like, like, ooh, don't mess with that guy. <laughs> Let's go mess with this little guy over here. Oh, my God! Oh, I'm dead! Fuck <laughs> <laughs> 
But that was our inaugural uh, Sigmar game. Uh, two player does get a little cutthroat. You know, it happens. Uh, we've gone through that several times. But because uh, if you draw a curse, you know who you're going to play. <laughs> Depends. There are some good curses that you want to curse yourself with. Also true, and it says that in the rules. Sometimes it's advantageous to curse yourself or to help your buddy in a way that would be disadvantageous. Do mm-hmm. it. Go it says. It says that. It says do it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, as I say, sometimes it just gets super one-sided, and uh, like we just don't get to do as much as we as we could to. Thwart the other guy. He just gets to walk away with it. But you know, <laughs> that's me. Is it Tank? <laughs> was, Tank wasn't here to throw a monkey wrench into the uh, into it. So yeah, <laughs> he's pretty good at that. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> but yeah, tell us what you think of uh, Age of Sigmar. Now that you've seen a few of the cards there, uh, I might keep it. Unmixed for a little bit, see if we can get another game in uh, with at least three players. That would be nice. Um, because I want to see some squigs. <laughs> you know my love for squigs. Oh, yeah. He's a squig guy. Yeah, it's like, Corey knows my love for squigs. Yeah, and my hatred for them yeah. in return. <laughs> uh, but he played Ogres uh, when we played uh, Warhammer Fantasy, which is the precursor to Age of Sigmar. And, uh, Ogres I, are big, so squigs can hit them. Yeah. And the Mangler squigs are just phenomenal at doing just amazing amounts of damage to them. Especially my Mangler squigs. I, I, call, them, I call them Mortimer and Archibald. <laughs> and uh, that, was, uh, that was after the initial names of Precious and Snowflake uh, of went over like a lead balloon. And... <laughs> <laughs> so, be sure to tell us what you think, and uh, like, tell us about the uh, twelve days of blurgness. Yeah, that's awesome. Think of that too, and uh, you know, I just decided to do something nice for the guys for the holiday and do it in a festive way because that's the reason for the season, you know. Yeah. And uh, if Matt's watching, I'm, and uh, I will send you yours as soon as the twelve days are over. You'll probably get it just after Christmas. So, you know. <laughs> Let's be bad and open them now. Let's be bad and that. Matt gets. Everything except this. I need one of these. <laughs> <laughs> but no, all of yours have an M on them as well. So, you know. <laughs> you will get 12 boosters in the mail with an M on them. And, uh... Until then, be sure to like, share, favorite, subscribe, play forward, send us money, be excellent to each other, and we'll see you next time.